Slow, slow, slow on my generals, on my lines, on my real men, on my kings, on my queens, on my princesses, on my lionesses. Y'all already know what it is. It's lines and men. It's your boy, True. Let's get into it. More or less, hit the like, hit the share, hit the subscribe. This is going to be a brief update on some information that was passed down to me from relatives, family, close to the beloved. You know what I mean? Historic, <laughs> legendary gangster of the Bronx. I mean, excuse me. LES, Lower Deck, Alphabet City, your boy Blue Boy. Unfortunately, it's not positive news. He's been denied any type of bond, you know what I mean, for his charges. The DA has gave him an offer. From what I heard, it was two offers. Which is just crazy. The first offer, I believe they said was a flat 15. You know, on top of his life charge already, he's doing life on parole. So, they offered him, allegedly, because I haven't been able to verify this shit outside, but this is the people that's related to him that told me this, so I'm taking it on their word. And salute to his family and everybody, man. Especially his kids. I know this shit is like crazy. So, again, 15 was the cop out. The cop out's been laid on the table for some months. And the second cop out, allegedly, as of last month, is a 10 flat. It appears. You know, Blue Boy ain't with that. And Blue Boy about to take this shit to trap. It seems like, you know, there is no stand your ground law in New York. So for all my New Yorkers, I mean, I know they are trying to change the laws now, right? For for store owners. That if they getting robbed, whatever New York City dudes just trying to run down in them bodegas ever since that last incident with that man. You know what I mean, that happened that he ended up killing the kid that was trying to rob the the store and they dropped the char charges on the poppy, you know what I mean? And it was within his right, you feel me? They was trying to just rob his spot and he held it down, excuse me. So, that's what happened. Now, they trying to start a whole wave where defending your property, defending your business will come within the means of you being able to arm yourself and protect yourself by all means necessary and not be prosecuted for any type of attempted murder, murder or assault charge. And I'm all for that, salute that. And that's going to be the beginning of everybody being able to have some some form of stand your ground law because it is not as of date today is the what the eighth or something like that i believe or the seventh some shit like that and as of date there is no law that prevents you from having to serve time or fight a case like blue boy is for attempted murder even though he was Defending the property of another establishment that's even owned by a ex NBA player, Big Baby. That's crazy, right? So I'll keep y'all informed. You know what I mean, definitely send this out, share it to the people that need to hear this. Unfortunately, you know what I mean, he's still on the island, allegedly, according to my sources. So if y'all want, I would donate to him. Forget his last name, I know it's Luis, but it, it won't be hard to find. All you gotta do is Google Blue Boy, New York City, Blue Boy Records on it, he'll pop up. Uh, it's Luis something, I forget, Luis. I forget, I don't wanna mess it up. But anyway, man, that's what I got for y'all on that note. As you see, your boy got the, the bag on. Now, man, all my Punisher shit, you feel me? Yeah, something like, <laughs> going, to, um, going to the library, you huh? Yo, I gotta up, I'm gonna do another video on your boy, Fat Joe, 
on that book that he got, the book of Jose, Fat Joe Memoirs. We're going to do a review on that. I started reading it. Very interesting, I have to say. So we're going to do something on that. Stay tuned. Holla at your twin. Hit the like, hit the share, hit the subscribe. Let me know if there's anything else that y'all want me to talk about, and I got y'all. Peace.